Hi, this is video one of putting the uh, railing, banister, and balustrade back up. I just wanted to show you the, uh, the different items you'll have. It's very important that two people uh, carry and hold the banister in place when you're moving it from uh, you know, on the floor to up on the stairs and back again. The hinge point is right here and uh, it's a, the weak spot. So if it's not supported by one person on this side of the balustrade and one person on this side of the balustrade, then, uh, then it could actually twist and come off here. So again, at least two people to put this into place. Uh, the other items that we have here are the actual poles uh, that connect to the balustrade. Uh, they're going to be labeled one through nine for you, uh, with one being the longest and on the bottom and nine being the shortest and on top. The other tools that you're going to need for this is a, 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 a wrench, uh, ratchet, uh, 11 millimeters. You're going to need a Phillips screwdriver and a, a flathead screwdriver. You'll also have uh, the accommodating bolts and uh, screws here of varying lengths. And then at the end, the two wood pieces that will go in to cover the, uh, the screw holes at, at the bottom. Um, and we'll show you more in the next video. You'll also have a drawing um, that will, uh, will help you and label all the different parts. I'll show on, on my phone here. So as you can see here, we'll have it labeled for you and it shows exactly where each piece goes and you can use this video to help guide you along with this uh, picture that we'll send along to you and the property manager.